Hi, Virgo. This is Jeffrey. This is Ripe Color. This is a reading for November 20th through 27th. Happy Thanksgiving if you're in the United States. I, I got to go. The mini message is um, surround yourself with people who love and um, support you. Like I got it really clear. Surround yourself with people who love and support you. Nothing else. Okay. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. I offer private readings. I also offer IET, which is a healing modality. Please become a member. Membership is two ninety nine dollars a month, and it allows you to watch these commercials, these um, videos commercial free. Uh, please go to my website and subscribe to my email list. Uh, I'm trying to build my email list, and I will be doing special offers on my website. <clears throat> and I am, I barely send an email, so, you know. I'm not one of those. Oh, I'm going to send you one every day. I'm going to send a reminder. You know, I don't do that. Because I hate when people do that. And honestly, I don't have it in me. You know, I'll put together a little newsletter, or whatever, with some pretty pictures and like some special and, you know, once a month. Maybe once every two weeks. But, you know, I get there are certain places to send me email every day. It's like, oh, my God. All right. Yeah. You know, you know me and my metaphors. So let's say, you know, you're making yourself something really grand to eat for yourself, right? And you have like, you know, I don't know, something you love like lobster or filet mignon or whatever it is, taco, whatever it is you love, right? And you have other things you love like your favorite cookies and your favorite fruit. And and then you put something down that you, you just, like it doesn't fit. And, and I feel like that's the way it is with the energy. The energy is like, just have like things that you love and that support you. Like when you eat it, you're like, oh my God, I feel like, at home and I feel loved and I feel, you know, like the way chocolate does. Um, and why would you eat something that's like, it's the same thing with the people in our lives. It's kind of the same thing. Just as simple as that. I say that a lot, don't I? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, here we go. Six of Wands, lovely card, the Hollywood card, being admired, being beloved, being seen in a position of power, being seen as a leader, being seen as and beloved and admired as somebody who knows what they're doing, somebody who is, um, who it's a pleasure to support, right? Victory, it's called a victory. And then I have the Hierophant, and the Hierophant, you know what I'm getting today? I'm getting your ethical. I'm getting that, you, you know, there's a certain honesty and a certain, um, like you do what you say you're going to do kind of energy, right? And people really, um, really appreciate that because... It's a lot rarer than you think. And um, people really rely on you for that. It helps them to become more into balance because sometimes they're not so, well, I have another two. So I have two twos or choices. This is really interesting. Three twos. Twos are about choices. One is leadership. Two is a choice, right? And then out of that choice comes three, which is creativity. So the choices here do I stay blind or do I open my eyes? Do I struggle or do I let go? 
Dubai. Rely on the way things were in the past. That was, or do I step forward into hope? Do I step forward into possibilities? Those are the choices. Those are the choices. You're supported. Sometimes I feel like a lot of us don't like step up and into our own intuition, our own light, our own um, grace, because it's like we're worried about what other people think, or we don't think that um, we're going to be supported. But I'm here to tell you that with this, so this is not only a support of people, it's a support of spirit. And this, which is probably like the most supportive card there is, because this, uh, you know, like the traditional meaning of this card, it, it's uh, it's about establishment. It's about hierarchy. It's about um, uh, government and institutions and, you know, things that are established, you know, and like don't really crumble. I mean, these days they do, but, you know, it's an energy of a card. <laughs> You know, it's like, this is something that's like rock solid, right? This is really like rock solid, it doesn't move. So I, I think the thing that doesn't move is really the love that spirit and, and the gifts that spirit has for you. So, you know, open your eyes to all the possibilities and understand that no matter what goes comes down the pike this guy always keeps the pentacles afloat you no know, like no matter what happens no matter what happens to the ship no matter how big the wave is it's like he always manages because they're he's supported right and you don't have to and this is established in love right these are the roses similar to venus and this is about love this it worked but it was limited. It's like, what would happen if I unlimited myself? And maybe unlimiting myself is really about inviting people in situations that love me at all, at all times, not ones who are like, they love you, you know, when things are good, or they love you when they want to borrow money, or they love you when they want you to listen to all their blah, blah, blah about nothing. But otherwise, they ain't got time for you. So, like, but if I, uh, like, surround myself with beautiful people who are really nourishing and kind and genuine and there and upstanding, then, then that's what I'm going to, you know, vibrate. That's what I receive. And, like, that can really, that's like, uh, you know, fertilizer. Yeah, you don't have to carry it alone. You don't have to carry it alone. Yeah, card of balance, card of community, card of giving and receiving. And the thing that's interesting about this card is like, we're all three. We're really all three in, in the reading. One day you're here and you're able to give. Another day it's like, bro, I'm really broke. Can you take me to lunch? Like, and your friend says, yeah, let's go something really nice. Let's go somewhere really nice. You know, they don't just like take you to like some crappy place. I don't want to name names. Yeah. I'm willingly giving up people who don't love and support me because it, stand, it doesn't serve me anymore. And I'm more illuminated now. So I'm willingly giving up those people who or those situations or those attitudes that don't fully 
love and support me. Look, you know, I have Virgo rising. I mean, it's, it's really what's going on with me. Like, so as you know, uh, well, I knew you don't know, but it's a whole long story. I've moved permanently to Mexico and uh, I lived in New York for a really long time. And um, some relationships that were real and long standing did not make it, did not make it. And how freeing it is. <laughs> Sometimes you get into a rut with certain people. Uh, it's like a habitual way of doing or being or acting. And it's like, it's like, well, I was picked up by the network, even though I was just the co-star in your movie, because I've always been the star in mine. I was picked up by the network. And as a matter of fact, I have a new advertising deal. Hi. Blessings. <laughs>